Hello and welcome. This is Greg French, and uh, today we're going to be making a game using codes and scripts, and we're using GameMaker 7 Lite. This is a download off the internet, and the Lite version is free. It's quite a bit that you can do in the Lite version, and we'll be creating a game today just using codes and scripts. Within GameMaker, there are uh, functions that can be used uh, to create actions, but there's limited to just a few. If you use the code, uh, you have access to over 1,000 functions within GameMaker, so you can create a pretty complex game. Uh, most of the games that we create are just in two dimensions or 2D, but GameMaker does have uh, the potential to go 3D, and also we can create uh, multi-user network games. But right now, we're just going to introduce you to a few uh, things with GameMaker. We're going to start off with the sprites. The sprites are nothing more than just pictures, and you can create these pictures using uh, several different tools, or you can download them off the internet. There's quite a few images that are on the internet that are free downloads, and we're going to take a few of those. Let's go ahead and create or check this little red face. This will open up our sprites uh, properties box. First thing we're going to do is load a sprite that we've downloaded off the internet. The first one is going to be this F117, because it's going to be a little shooter program that we're going to create. Here's our F117 comes up, and we're going to go ahead and open up that. Our box, uh, properties box shows it being selected. We're going to change the name. They always suggest that you change your sprite names to give it something that uh, you can identify later. And we're going to select the smooth edges. This will help to make it appear a little bit better in the game, a little smoother. Now we can edit this. There's quite a few selections for editing. We'll use some of these later for the other sprites. Click OK. The next one we're going to add is our MIG. We're going to have a MIG that we're going to be using. Go ahead and select Open. Our MIG appears in our Sprite Properties box. Uh, we'll change the name again. And uh, we'll call a MIG, SPR MIG. Uh, again, we're going to smooth the edges. We need to rotate him. He's facing up and he should be facing down because he's going to enter the game from the top of the screen. So select Edit Sprites, select Transform, and just rotate 180. You can see it's facing down now. Select OK. And now we have him facing downwards. That's going to be what we want. Uh, next, we're going to uh, select or add a bullet because we're going to have to have some projectiles firing from our F-117 at our MIG. So come up here. Add bullets and load the sprite again, and it's going to be the bullet. I made this little bullet using uh, just uh, Microsoft's Paint program. So open that up again, smooth the edges, and OK. OK, now we've created the three sprites, and uh, these are the sprites that we're going to use for this game they're going to create. That's it for this segment. The next segment is concerning objects. Thank you.